Take the EV safety design as an example. An EV battery pack has to be designed so that it meets the safety standards upon a site's impact. With every design change in the battery pack, a physics-based simulation has to be performed to test whether the design meets the safety requirements. Now, with a trained machine learning model, the engineer submits a design change and gets to see the results in a few seconds. The results from a machine learning prediction is as rich as a physics-based simulation. We could see how the impact force changes over time and the entire 3D animation of the crash event to understand what will happen to the battery cell upon impact. Machine learning models trained from physics-based simulations bring many thousand times speed up to predict the 3D results in space and time. This could enable almost an interactive 3D design environment that turns weeks and months of design cycle into hours and potentially change the way products are designed and optimized. In the near future, with almost instantaneous 3D feedbacks from neural networks, car makers could quickly evaluate and optimize their battery pack designs for better safety. Doctors could quickly screen and find the matching candidates for a clinical trial. Aircraft manufacturers could design landing gears that last for longer. Bottle packaging could be made lighter and more sustainable. With machine learning, simulations could become smarter, able to solve new challenging problems difficult to solve before. Detailed 3D information from simulations could become really valuable for machine learning. Simulations could really enrich sparse experimental observations, critical for the training of balanced and reliable AI. I can't wait to see how simulations and machine learning together changes the way of scientific computing.